you do an arm lock when uh, when when Uke is completely flat. Now when Uke is in a turtle position, you guys know you can do the Neil Adams roll, you can do the Yeskovich roll, right? You put your legs in and you roll them. But when they're completely flat, you can't really do the roll anymore. Right? Because when they're completely flat, there's no space to roll them, right? So you have to do a different type of uh, uh, Gigi Takami. You need to get a figure four grip, okay? So when you're here, you can turn this way. Okay. So you, the way to get a figure four grip usually is you want to distract, okay? So you make him think you're focusing on the choke, okay? If you focus on the arm, you pull his arm in, then you, you can't get it. Right? So if I'm like, focusing on a choke, he's, he's protecting, look, he's protecting like that, then I got the arm. Okay? So the first thing you want to do is to get the figure four. Right? Your left arm secures it first. That's the first thing. Just get that left arm here. Once you've got that, then you bring this over and you twist it like this. And this is the figure four that you want. Okay? Like this. The, the left arm holds here, you hold here, then you go like this. Okay, so it's one, two, three. One, two, three. Okay, so I got one, two, three. Got it? Right? That's your figure four. One, two, three. Now once I've got the figure four secure, what I want to do is I want to use this, my forearm, to dig into his neck. Make it very uncomfortable for him. Okay? Digging in his neck, he's like really, really uncomfortable. You know, it's really a lot of pain. You can see, Taiwan's not very happy. <laughs> so, what happens is when you dig into him and you're pressing into him, he's feeling so much pressure. The minute you release the pressure, you'll come bouncing up because he's been being suppressed, right? I'm pressing it down on his neck. The minute I release the pressure, he comes up a little bit. And you use that momentum to come into a Juji Katami. Okay, I'll show you. I'm this, right? I'm pressing and making him suffer, making him suffer, right? Then when I suddenly release, I come over and I've got the Juji Katami. I see that? I've got Juji Katami. Right? It's as straightforward as that. There's no role involved. Okay, it's action reaction. I push him down, make him uncomfortable, make him suffer. I can just dig right in here, make him suffer. He's really uncomfortable, right? Then the moment I'm ready to go, right? I release, he comes up, I go here. Okay, then I reposition myself and I get a good Juju Katami. Okay, if I'm pressing into his face like this, I tell you the minute you release, he'll come up a little bit because to release the pressure. Okay?